France is throwing a party, marking the end of its monarchy more than two centuries ago. The traditional Bastille Day parade and the military flyover commemorate the storming of the Bastille prison in Paris in 1789. In tiny villages and ancient cities, from one end of the country to the other, France was under orders to have a good time. The National Millennium Committee had wanted Bastille Day 2000 to be something special. And since it was the French who invented the word picnic, what else could people do but spread out their tablecloths, open up their baskets, and help the national effort to stage the incredible picnic, the largest picnic ever? Regional products were served up by the boatload, and mass barbecue grilling went on coast to coast, 600 miles along a 17th century geographic line called the Green Meridian. Sponsors donated 400 miles of red check tablecloths for the occasion, and participants were encouraged to be creative from there. So they played soccer in front of ancient ruins and flew model airplane dogfights in the sky. In Paris, 12,000 French mayors gathered for a million dollar lunch in the gardens of the Senate. And the uninvited could always find a little something to eat on a bridge across the River Seine.